America. You're being a hypocrite. No, 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 you listen. No, 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 you listen. United States of America, you are out of order. Everything goes down to USA, and I know most of them are going to bombard me with a whole lot of questions, some relevant, some very irrelevant. But USA, like I said, maximum pressure, so I'm ready for them. Good morning, candidates. I'd like to welcome you all to this community council session. The topic is stabilizing the Middle East, the situation in the Strait of Hormuz. The current tensions can, however, be traced between. I believe America upholds self-determination of countries. Your demands seem to temper with the self-determination of Iran. Senor Presidente, gracias. The United Kingdom again is emphasizing this fact that we do not want escalation of tensions in the area. And in this innocence of it is necessary. Russia is right to admit to our grammatical error because you don't speak English, but it's right to say on authority that there is no international waters. The fact I allow you to walk through my land does not make my land a public land for you. Belgium believes it's about time the world focused on expanding other so that Iran can't hold us hostage. The people of Iran are suffering. In doing that, it will affect the economy of Iran. That is why we are using the Strait of Hormuz. Because not only that, the Security Council proceedings have been quite intense. You can help. Well, that is why we are called a diplomat. But it means that a lot of it will depend on your training. As I said, the hand of God, the right moment, okay, and the training that you get, which is what you are already getting, starting from now, the training. My simple majority is motion practice, and we are going to be talking about the for one hour. Now, that is the that like you know this is yes this is the the motion passes and uh, you will see the An oil tanker has been seized off the coast of Iran in the Strait of Hormuz by the Iran nation. President of the Security Council of the House, this is the vital update that the Bureau has realized. Thank you. Moment, I will give member states a few moments to confer with their respective uh, embassies back of them and update this council of the position of your country so we got this today. The procedure actually rightly said was that um, this foreign town kind of passion goal was selected for the South Asian countries. The EU would like to recommend that Iran please refrain from taking us back as we are here to settle this issue right now. Iran is trying to say that we are not going to do this demand. So if they can make up their mind some other way. Delegate Russia has to assist the CEO will confirm with the trade industry in Russia and also uh, the EU. I'm very much disappointed in the EU and even with my allies in the EU that you were able to set and make and do this and give, give this to me to, to send to who? Now let me make this, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me understand that USA <coughs> might stop, might stop sponsoring the UN. What you are doing is what we call solitudinal facing facing appellate. In the in the spirit of the United Nations Charter, which they signed to, United States is a disappointment to the highest degree. And I run you as more fully in no one's interest. Delegates in favor of passing this draft element into resolution kindly indicate so by raising a placard. Delegates against this motion. No abstain. The United States, would you like to speak on the veto? Okay. 
Thank you very much. Iran has refused to meet the criteria that we have provided. And for that matter, this resolution cannot go. Thank you. This motion fails to pass due to a meeting in the United States of America. I'd like to thank you all once again for your time. This is Grand High and it's high school session here. Learned a lot. I got to realize the importance of our diplomats and their role in the Security Council towards peace and security. And then skills I wouldn't have found anyway. Besides having fun meeting new people, you also learn to build your confidence. I met prolific people here. Which who think on their toes and are brilliant. This particular program, in line with the Lifelink of the United Nations Conference, made me meet a whole lot of people who have different stands when it comes to diplomacy and then international relations. I have learned the art of diplomacy and learned to reach consensus, though with dividing or divergent views. I think this is a good start. You avoid yourself to be grown. I really enjoyed this good news session and I'd like to recommend it to other tertiary students. To participate in future Lifeling Model United Nations conferences and good news, visit our website www.lifelinghana.com. Follow us on our handles on Facebook, Twitter and IG at Lifeling Ghana. You will be amazed by the wonderful testimonies and the live videos of our section. <laughs>